Okay, so the last thing I'm going to show you how to do is once you've got everything together, you want to make sure that it's ready to export. So one of the first things I would recommend is okay. go and setting an out point. And you can do that by pressing O. This basically allows you to make sure that your audio is going to stop at this point. The big reason for this is a lot of times when you're working with stuff, you'll throw things further and further down. And if you don't set an out point by pressing the O button, it will export everything. So you could have, depending on how far away you throw things, thing like five to 10 minutes to an hour's worth of silence, and then that little bit that you didn't see. So always just get to the end there, listen to everything, make sure it sounds proper. It's going to export what you're hearing. So if you have just one track soloed, that's all it's going to do. Once you've gone through, listen to it, make sure it's okay. You're going to go to file, export, multi-track mix down, and then you want to choose the time selection, that first option there. It's going to name it Demo Mix Down. Um, you'll want to rename this with the name of the project. So, O2 Audio Project, your name, whatever. Right here, once again, you want to make sure that you're saving it, not to your Documents folder, but to your external folder here, and I'm going to save it right into there. You haven't saved it yet. You need to actually hit OK. Everything else here should be this should be fine. Hit OK. It's going to take a minute or so, depending on how long your piece is. And once it's done, all you want to do is make sure you go to your folder. And on a Mac, there it is right there. You can hit the space bar and that'll let you preview hey. it. And you wanna make sure that you listen to the entire thing to make sure it's okay before you turn it in. And that is how you export out your project. Happy editing.